Hi, I'm Deandra, and I was here just to talk to you today about some of the things that I find interesting, who I am, uh, my personal feelings about men and relationships and everything, just love and romance. Um, I was raised in Washington, D.C. I'm a military brat, I've been all over the world, and I'm also a veteran. So I've seen, you know, different cultures, I've seen beautiful people, I've seen places where nudity is acceptable, you know, so I'm very open-minded to love and sex and relationships. Um, one of my main focuses about love and men is just trusting yourself and knowing that whatever you do, is, it's okay. It's okay to be yourself. It's okay to open up to men. It's okay to make mistakes. Um, as far as me, there's, like I said, I have a lot of different interests. I love to dance, I love music, I love poetry, I love to go out. I don't know if you've ever been to New Orleans, but that's a great place for romantic blues nights, you know, kind of like that video with, um, what's it called? Uh, I think it was in vogue and they had the red gloves on and the smoky. That's kind of who I am, you know, that's what I like to see and feel. But other than that, I just love the view. You know, I love to be out places like this at night and just be romantic. I mean, you don't know, you can lay down a little blanket and you know, do things that only people do in the dark, Yeah, there's just, it's just a, it's a choice, you know, and it's, I, I choose to have people be open, I choose to teach other people to, to accept who they are and to express themselves to the fullest, you know, to, to find that person and just open yourself up to that person and have no regrets about what they decide to do in the meanwhile, you know, as long as you were who you wanted to be, as long as you experienced something fabulous to you. One of my most memorable situations was in, in a situation where it wasn't really a long-lasting relationship. It was just the perfect atmosphere, the perfect night, the perfect wine, the perfect food. You know, I love sushi. I don't know, that's an aphrodisiac for some. You know, I, I think that it's only one life to live. If you're safe, if you protect yourself, it's okay to go out and have a good time. It's okay to have a one-night stand. It's okay to find someone that you want to love forever. Um, and the other, the other flip side of it, of course, is the AIDS epidemic, you know, the STDs and all that good stuff. But, you know, they have flavored everything. You know, there's nothing you can't do sexually and still protect yourself. There's nothing you can't do in, in this world, you know. Why not go out and explore? Why not find somebody that is willing to just see the world with you? And that's, that's something I've been looking for, and I haven't really found it. It's someone that'll just up and go. You know, if I want to, let's go to the... Uh, let's go to California, let's go to Germany, let's go overseas, let's go to the beach, you know, let's go be in a film or, you know, we can, there's so much we can do, but a lot of people are just kind of stuck in their little box, in their little square, you know, and I'm not against, you know, DC men per se, but a lot of them don't like to go out of the city, you know, so I, I kind of give a word to most men out here, if you can try to just kind of broaden your horizons, there's a little more than Myrtle Beach, you know, a lot of guys like to take you to Virginia Beach. Um, but I, you know, I think that they should stretch it a bit, you know, get a passport, go somewhere, do something. There's a whole world, there's a whole world to see. There's so much that people are missing out on. You know, I've been to Turkey, you know, it's not just dealing with the foreigners and, and terrorist threats. There's a beautiful place, you know, there's these just beautiful restaurants and outdoor events, you know, there's cruises. You know, currently I have a travel business called um, Travel 99. And what I do with that is I, I'm able to get discounts. So if I got a guy and he's not willing to up and go, it's like, well, what's the problem? We got the money, we have the discounts, we have the free hotel stay. They're just a lame mo you need to move on. You know, you just need to find somebody that's going to really explore who you are and who they are. You know, there's just too much out here. You know, it's just a lot. It's a lot to do and see. And I just, I just ask everybody to just find yourself and find a place in the world. And don't just live every day, but enjoy every day.